this tutorial student will learn different isolation methods that are used for culturing of microbes in coming series of videos we will discuss study of fermented products on specified media there are basically three different isolation methods that are used for culturing of microbes straight plate method pore plate method and spread plate method first we will discuss straight plate method For straight plate method, following procedure is used. Label the petri plates with isolation method and date. This will also help to identify the microorganisms, and it, I, although it may take some times. but it may lead to help to avoid the big mistake later on secondly check agar plates if any moisture is present then it is preferable to place them in an incubator for overnight now pour the melted agar on sterile petri plate sterile the mouth of flask with the help of separate lamp and pour molded agar on sterile petri plate carefully place the petri plate on side now check agar plates if any moisture is present then it is preferable to place them at room temperature for overnight third step is addition of inoculum inoculum from another plate then it is preferable to use single colony from inoculated plate for inoculation first flame this inoculating loop to red hot then allow it to cool for 1 to 2 minutes pick single colony from plate now stick in a slightly rapid movement to avoid the gorging of agar plate after inoculation again red hot the loop Now place the inoculated plate in an incubator in inverted position at 37 degree centigrade for overnight. After incubation, observe the plate at a safe distance from face. Isolation method part 2. Pore plate method. Pore plate method is also a pure culture technique which is used for isolation of microbes. It is very economical way for food labs to test to perform test on a samples that focused on specific number of bacteria for pore plate method following procedure is used first set the micro pipette on a specified volume which is 100 microliter now for second step we use inoculum to inoculate the empty petri plate for inoculum addition we take culture mayer 100 microliter of culture and spread it evenly on petri plate discard the micropathet now pour melted agar on inoculated plate for inoculation sterilize the mouth of flask and pour melted agar uniformly 
on plate. According to recommendation, it is preferable to fill the plate to 12 to 15 ml. Now place the plate in laminar to dry. After this, place plate in incubator at 37 degrees centigrade for overnight. Set the incubator at desired temperature. As I required 37 degrees centigrade, so now actual temperature is 30 and it will set at 37. After a few minutes, it will automatically adjust to the set point temperature. After overnight incubation, we will observe the plates and the colonies were calculated with the help of colony counter. After the calculation of colonies, we will also find out colony forming unit with the help of formula. This is the basic two isolation methods, four plate and straight plate. Isolation method part three, spread plate method. Spread plate method is a technique which is used to place the liquid sample containing bacteria so that bacteria are easily count and isolate. A successful spread plate method will have countable number of colonies that are evenly isolated on agar surface. For the spread plate method, falling procedure is used. Melt the agar and allow it to cool less than 50 degrees centigrade. Now take sterile petri plate and pour melted agar on plate. After pouring, place the plate for some time to dry. Now take already poured plate and use spreader for spreading of inoculum. If you use glass spreader then it is preferable to dip the spreader in an alcohol and then flame it on burner. This is disposable spreader. Now I set the pipette to 1000 microliter and take 1 ml culture. Pour the inoculum on the surface of agar. Now discard the tip. Spread the inoculum evenly on the surface of agar plate. Continue spreading until it fully absorbs on the surface of agar. It is recommended during the spreading Place the plate in front of flame to avoid the risk of contamination. As agar is fully absorbed on the agar surface, close the lid of plate and place in an incubator at 37 degrees centigrade. For incubation, place the plates in an incubator at 37 degrees centigrade for overnight. After overnight incubation, again observe the plate and at a safe distance from the face. Count the number of colonies with the help of colony counter and also calculate the colony forming unit from isolated colonies.